the trouble is you think you have time and yes while there is infinite time there is also the precious precious knowing of how important our individual actions are and how important it is for all of us to step into the reality that we see in the future and the courageous the compassionate the wild confidence inside of ourselves in our harmony with the spiritual creator that made us into this reality and that we chose into this life that we chose into this time, that we chose into seeing the tragedies of Didi and Israel Gaza and an unspeakably long list of tragedies that are potentially our greatest triumphs. And so I'm speaking to you now. I'm calling forth the world changers and I'm here to create a community of those who are uniting together to know, to feel, and to believe that they are not crazy that you are seeing the world in the midst of a great transformation and that you are meant to be a transformational force in it. You are meant to be one of the ones. You can be one of the ones who makes a massive transformational change in the world. And that's why we exist. That's why Ori is here. That's why I'm speaking this message. That's why we share the emails every day that we are. That's why Stage Secrets exist, is to help you create the live and virtual stages and places and group coaching containers to help people with your unique individual magic to help people transform out of their trauma, out of their drama, and into their peace and into their power and into their prosperity. And that is why this is all happening. From a cosmic perspective, this is why this is all happening, is so that we can step into the knowing, step into the expression, step into the power of being one of those warriors of the light that is here to look at these objective disasters and be someone who is strong enough to end the patterns of tragedy and karma in your family, to be the one that can stand in the breach of saying, I'm going to fall back into these ineffective and awful ways of being, or I'm going to step forward into being one who can make massive, beautiful, positive change in the world and be comfortable being known in all of your shadow, all of your light and seen, be seen, Ultimately, we all deeply want to be seen, but we allow our identities to be held back. We allow our egos to draw us back and we allow resistance to pull us back into our former selves and close up and close in and breathe shallow breaths instead of stepping up and saying, here I am. This is me. This is what I feel. This is what I believe. This is what I'm here to share. And when we do that, when we step up into that, when we feel that energy and that knowing, the angels come to our aid, the synchronicities surround us. And if my life is any example to the limited extent that it has been successful, and in certain ways it certainly has, and there's a long, long way to go. But as I have done that, it has been proven to me that there is a divine infrastructure to this reality, that the allies and the assistants and the miracle workers are here. They are surrounding us. They are embodying our knowing that there is a magical and a mystical and a miraculous nature to this reality and that you have the potential to be one of those people. You do. And that you without entitlement, deserve that. And even more than deserving it, you have the fucking responsibility to do so. You have the fucking responsibility to not turn a blind eye to others who are suffering and to the world that is suffering due to a lack of the magical fucking miracle workers potentially like you who are meant to share their voices, who are meant to embody their truth, who are meant to step up and say, yes, here I am, as flawed and as fucked up and as fucked over as I've been, I'm here to step into this expression and allow myself to be perfected in the process because spirit does not call the perfect, but he, she, it perfects the called through the process of going on our individual hero's journeys, through the process of going on our individual tragic, triumphant, just crazy life stories, but through uniting with the guides that are here in this reality. And for me, Yeshua, Mary Magdalene, being the 
biggest forces of inspiration and spiritual nourishment in my life. And I draw inspiration from many other faiths, but those are the two where I find my fucking power and the deepest resonance in my being and the most interactive experiences that I've had in prayer and meditation through psychedelics. Those beings have shown up to me in the most beautiful, high vibrational, pure, powerful, loving ways that I can imagine that feel so far beyond me in the ways that they've shown up, that feel so far beyond anything I could imagine in the way that they've shown up in my experience. And maybe that's the same for you. Maybe not. But I do invite you to go on that journey because that's where I found my greatest light. And you know, at the same time, my shadows get exposed every day. Um, I'm angry. I'm judgmental. I'm arrogant. <laughs> I'm bitter. I'm resentful. You know, I can be all of those things. I shouldn't say I am those things, but I can exhibit those behaviors. And, and I know that those are not the best expressions of me. And those are not the identities of the creator. <sighs> While they are within the creation, they are not the highest expression of what our truth really is meant to be. So we're all being invited into this deep shadow work experience here on earth and seeing, again, Diddy and Israel Gaza and all these Epstein and all the tragedies, all the conspiracy crazy shit that's happening, all that's being exposed by these dark magicians and all this crazy, crazy ritualistic stuff that's happening at CERN and the human sacrifice stuff and just the, the most horrible things you can imagine that, that uh, do appear to be happening. And they've been happening throughout human history for a really, 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 really long time. Human sacrifice has been part of countless cultures. And there are, there do appear to be spiritual entities that these people are praying to, Baal and others. And it's really fucking crazy, the reality in which we find ourselves. And these tragedies can either break us or they can build us into the world change that we're meant to be. We can step into our heroic power. We can step into our presence. We can step into our life purpose. And that is what I'm calling you to do. And that is what I'm calling you to be. And the best way I figured out how to do that is to create the organization that we've created and to provide the service that we're providing so that you can embody those truths and learn the system, techniques, technology to express them to the world for maximum impact and fulfillment and peace and celebration and drop into the most magnificent states of being that we've, we can ever experience is in our highest service. And by being in that highest service, we can experience incredible success. And that's what I'm here for. And that's the reality that I invite you into. So should you choose to accept, we're here for you. And the links are below. And you can click and get access right now. Um, enrollment closes at the end of next week. And I would love to have you on the journey. But if now is not the time, that's okay. And it's never going to be the time. It's never going to feel like it's the right time. But it always is the right time. We can always make time if we care enough. And if we see that burning building bright enough in front of us to jump into that burning building and save the children and the puppies that are inside and, and use that analogy to go save the people that you're meant to save. And there's someone out there that has, that's inside of a burning building of their own mind, of their own pain. And you're meant to go be one of those people. You can be one of those people. So I hope you step into that and I sure would appreciate if you subscribed. I'd love to stay in contact with you. And so please click below. And if this moved you, please share your thoughts. It would mean a lot to me and would love to continue being on this mission. So if this is a message you want to get out there, like, comment, subscribe, and we'll see you soon. Thank you.